Hey there campers, it's Barry here with Southern RV and we are back on the sales lot today to take a look at the Zinger 270BH. This is a single slide, corner bunk, corner bath style model. It comes in dry at about 6,200 pounds and with this just 27 foot living space box, there's not a whole lot to look at. So this should be a pretty quick video today. So stick with us and we'll check out some of the features. Let's get started right up front. As we walk up to the front of the vehicle, what we notice is that we have this nice rock guard down low, an electric front tongue jack, a cover for our LP bottles, our battery housing location is here, and we have a small plug where we are wired to do trickle charge on solar. So there isn't a panel on there, but it could be installed. We have a pass-through storage up front, and if we duck down, notice that we have a switch, and that's going to control our electric jacks. These are stabilization jacks, not leveling jacks, but they do run up and down at the touch of a button. Leaning down and looking up under, notice that we have an enclosed underbelly. That's going to help in the winter time, as far as keeping all of your tanks and stuff from freezing, so long as you're running the heat. Up above we do have a large electric awning and that is lit by LED. You can see the strip right along the top corner there. We even have a couple of outside speakers. That's what those two little guys are. And right over here, you'll notice that up under our patio, we have power as well as a cable jack. So we can run a TV outside if we wanted to. That's not a big deal. Pushing around to the back of the camper, we find that the bumper plays host to our spare tire. This is pre-wired for a backup camera to be installed. And there's an outside shower right here off the back as well. The power cord in this one is integrated, so it simply pulls out of the wall. And if we look here, we'll find that we have a little bit of extra storage. So plenty of outside storage on this guy. And then right down below here in the back, that's going to be where our dump station is. This is run on a rack and pinion style slide system, as you can see here. And we have a leaf spring style suspension. Let's push back around to the front of the vehicle and hop up in. Alright, so climbing up into the vehicle, the first thing that we come to on our left is going to be our control panel just as soon as we come through the door. This has our slide switch as well as our awning switch and immediate access to a series of lights, including, I have this one flipped off right now, but I'll cut it on. This one has some mood lighting on board in the form of those blue lights that you see there. So that's kind of cool of the evening. You can set it up to have kind of a party mode or just a, a low light mode as it were. As you can see, we have our slide out and this is the entire living room, dining room and back bunk area all in one space here. Now I will point out that this couch is going to be a jackknife sofa so it can lay flat it's about the size of a double bed once it lays flat same here with the u-shaped dinette that table can drop down the cushions can move out and we have another bed for this camper so and then that doesn't include these two in the back these corner bunks they're almost full-size beds that you can see stacked over each other with the ladder heading up 
and it's got a nice blackout curtain to surround them just so that they can have some privacy or just stay in the dark afterwards so that's one two three and four beds that are in this room alone if needs be across from our couch here we have our entertainment system so you would put your flat screen TV on that back wall. There's a mounting plate for it. Note that this does come with a Bluetooth sound bar and there's plenty of storage all around it for setting up other devices. I'll back up just a hair here and we'll take a look at our kitchen. Our kitchen consists of a single stainless steel basin sink. We've got storage and drawers beneath our oven as well as a three burner stove top that's covered with glass so that we can get some extra counter space when we need it and then up top up here we have our microwave and a little bit more storage to the right of that we find that we have a norco refrigerator this is a decent sized refrigerator and it contains it's actually a uh, DC fridge 12 volts so it's not the gas electric that's why we don't see the cooling fins in the back back there it gives us just a little more volume inside one thing that I do really like about this model is that they've carved out the space for a really good sized pantry let me open this up here so as you can see we've got multiple shelves running up and down part of that could be used for kid clothes storage and part of it could be used for dry goods you could set that up a bunch of different ways the door that's on the in the back just across from our beds there that's going to lead into the bathroom notice that we have our thermostat set up on the wall right next to it there's our shower. It's got a small skylight above. Looking down, we see we have a foot flush toilet, some nice storage, our sink with storage beneath. And then looking back up, we see that we've got our medicine cabinet and mirror. We'll spin around and push towards the front of the camper here. And look at that main bedroom. So our primary bedroom here has a queen bed and it's surrounded by closets on the left and the right. And then there's also storage up under the bed as well. It's a walk around. And if you look, we have windows on both sides so that we can catch a cross breeze in there. They've also given us like a nice little spot to set our phones and made sure that we have power on both sides of the bed as well. So charging in the night or setting up an alarm clock is not going to be an issue. Guys, as I said at the beginning of this, this isn't going to be a super long one. That's the interior and exterior of the 270BH. If you have questions or you'd like to see it for yourself, come visit us here at Southern RV in McDonough, Georgia, or visit us online at southernrv.com. Until next time, happy camping. <music>